Hey everybody, it's Rachel Old Beauty and it's a Friday night and I just got in from a very, very exciting event hosted by myself and Miss Vaughn along with celebrity artist, um, Mary, featuring celebrity artist Mary Mary and I want to thank the people over at African Pride for asking me to hope the asking me to host the Ultimate Beauty Social. If you want to see the details on that event, um, I invite you to go to my blog at rachelobeauty.com where you'll get a full post on um, what we were celebrating, African Pride, and all the good stuff behind the scenes at the um, Mary Mary event tonight. Today's video is all about Ambi skincare and how to properly wash your face. I thought to myself how appropriate to do this video tonight because I'm just coming in, I got a lot of makeup on, and so I want to show you guys what my nightly routine is. Take a little cotton ball and I use an eye makeup remover. This one is by Almay. And I just start to remove the eyeliner and mascara. Now I'm going to use the same cotton ball with the eye makeup remover to remove the red lipstick that I had on. This is everything that Ambi sent me. The first item is the Gentle Essential Cleanser. This one is great for combination skin. The second item is the Exfoliating Wash with Salicylic Acid, which is more for someone that has acne or um, breakouts. I'm showing you that I don't use it every day. I use it where I have breakouts, which would be around my chin and my forehead. I'm using the Gentle Cleanser because I have combination skin. I love this, cl this cleanser because it's wonderful for when I'm wearing makeup and even when I'm not wearing makeup, it really gets rid of any of the impurities on my skin um, and you want to make sure that when you're cleansing your skin, you're removing your makeup in an upward circular motion. Try not to rub or tug your skin too roughly. But I'm showing you a little movement that I do as an esthetician is called effleurage. So upward circular motions to remove your makeup. You also want to make sure, ladies, that whatever you do to your face, you go down to your neck and remove the cleanser remove any dirt or um, pollutants on your neck area. My tip is to remo always remove your makeup with a white washcloth. Sometimes if you use washcloths that are colored, they have dyes in them. And for some people, that can break out your skin. So always try to use a white washcloth. Now I'm going in with the exfoliating wash and just giving my lips a little special treatment. This cleanser has micro beads in it, so it will help to polish your skin and make it very smooth. And so I'm using my facial brush and I'm just polishing my lips and making sure that all of the lipstick is off, all the dead dry skin is off, and this works wonderful for that. I'm also going to go ahead and do the same thing on my forehead because I have a little bit of breakout here. So you see the water there and this again is the exfoliating wash from Ambi with salicylic acid. Make sure you spray your toner to restore the pH balance to your skin. And then last but not least, I'm using the Essentials Daily Moisturizer with Broad Spectrum Sunscreen. Make sure that you're using a sunscreen that has broad spectrum in it and you want to make sure that you're just pressing the moisturizer into your skin again you're not rubbing or tugging your skin um, too much just press it in to learn more about Ambi you can go to ambiflawlessskin.com this product is made for African Americans great for hyperpigmentation thank you for watching this video